I'm a, a moderna man. Hey, it's Werner, and this is Finding Frequency. This morning, Martha and I left way early, drove about an hour and a half outside Warsaw, and got our first round of vaccinations. So the weird situation that I was talking about before wasn't so weird. It's just uh, that my father-in-law knows of a director of a hospital that runs um, a vaccination station, and they are not getting a lot of people going through the station. So um, they're kind of redirecting some people to this vaccination point. And if you have an official government vaccination and it's in, within a couple of weeks or days, they uh, actually allow you to come and do your vaccination. And then they reset everything. So got, went through the system, got my Moderna injection. My arm is a little bit numb, but I haven't grown any horns. I don't, and also don't feel like voting Republican or anything. So I think I got away unscathed. And um, yeah, so the, uh, they also SMS the, the government. So it's all kind of nice and uh, smooth. And I've already received my date for the next vaccination, then right back at that same point. So it, it is, it was worth the while. Actually, also a little bit of adventure with Marta spending the morning in the car um, away from the laptops and screens and just talking about what we hopefully want to do with our housey if it, if it comes through and also um, after that went to pick up my uh, new glasses which I'm wearing right now I'm now bespeckled and I can actually see much better it's crazy when you have like proper reading glasses everything looks just much better and uh, yeah I must say I'm looking at myself in the mirror now not too shabby <laughs> magic glasses so uh, what a day um also went, uh, jumped on the bicycles this afternoon because I have a little gap between uh, sessions. I've got a virtual event coming up that I'm hosting. So uh, jumped on the bicycles to go fetch Francie at the kindergarten. So it's a nice tail end to the day. And then uh, I just need to do another hour and a half of a little bit of work and then um, hang out with the fan family. So uh, I think that's kind of the extraordinary of the day if I think about everything that's gone gone on the couple last couple of months um and uh well it feels more like last year and a bit um this is definitely a mile a milestone and uh, it's funny that when you tell people you get a lot of love you get a lot of congratulations i think it's kind of we all want to go through it and and hopefully face something more positive after this also in Poland, um, they are relaxing restrictions a little bit next week, from next week. Also in the horizon is, um, as per the US, seems that they're also going to relax the mask um, mandate specifically when you are outdoors, which I am super excited about. I'm really not enjoying wearing the mask. Uh, not that I have anything against it. I actually think it's awesome also, I think I'll be wearing it in future if I feel fluey to protect people from my germs. I think it's something that we need to start doing. But just when I'm outdoors and it's getting a bit hotter and like even in winter though, it's just it's just a pain in the ass to wear this face covering. But um, hopefully that will be something of the past, at least if some of the other things remain, if we can shift that to the, to the side, especially when you're in groups of people that have, that have been vaccinated. So... Let's see how it plays out. I can't can't predict, but um, keep on wearing your mask. It's not an anti-mask episode. It's just looking forward to a little bit more freedom when the time is right. So yeah, I think that is a good enough update. Cool man, hang in there if you haven't had your time yet, or um, you know, yeah, just hang in there. We nearly we're getting there. We're getting there. Great. Thanks for listening.